Alrighty, seems how I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I did have the slab, uh, a couple of little still shots of it as I cut it down with a chainsaw. Of course, I have no guides or anything, so I really don't have a clue what I'm doing. I thought it'd be kind of fun. I'm going to see if I can take these. They're a little bit wobbly and whatnot, but uh, we're going to try to send them through the planer and just see if we can get them kind of halfway right. This log has been sitting for, I don't know, half a year or so, so... We probably won't be able to get it all the way to finish, but I would like to at least see if I can get it uh, somewhat planed down and squared up or something just to see what it does. It's a nice little cedar log. So we're going to throw it through the, the uh, planer and see what it does. Okay, so it didn't work so well. So what I've done is set up the saw and uh, we're playing with this thing a little bit and I just Cut this down a little bit on both sides of this one. Squared up the edges, but I noticed we got a lot of rock to it. So what I'm going to do is try to take and flatten that out a little bit and put a ledger board across that, screw it onto there. And that way it'll hold it square enough to where I can probably run the planer across that and use that as a guide instead. So we're going to do that next and see how it works out. All right, we got one of them. I think it's going to look pretty nice. That's a pretty piece of wood. Uh, now we're going to set up the camera see if I can kind of, now that I've done one, I won't kind of want to waste quite so much time with it, maybe. So we're going to go ahead and uh, try this next piece. So let me set up the camera and see if we're ready to go. All right, so we've got our next one we're going to try to do. We've got to, first of all, take this off of here a little bit. We don't need that. And... Uh, set it up for the table saw to give us an approximate position. Get it. Uh, okay. Start that up. see it. What I think I want to do again is this thing rocks a little bit so we're going to kind of find the middle of the two and we're going to put this board and this board on either side to kind of just hold it in place. We can run it through the through the planer. We'll start with this one about halfway in the time. sure that it will hold. And this side is on the ground there. And of course it will be on it there, I think, too. And that might be just a little bit more. Get this. Little rocks. We'll turn this around. I need to hold that just like Send through the 
planer and that should ride right along it. And we'll start taking this down to get it somewhat and hopefully we'll be able to uh, not go quite that deep. Let's see how far we have to go to just kind of get it a little bit closer. So now we can uh, set it up. <laughs> smoothed off. So I'm going to take these runners off so I can get it to actually see if I can hit the top half of that. I don't want to take a and hit these screws in that cleaner. Get a little bit of a challenge. I may end up having to put them back on when I'm all done. Do I can put them down on the bottom side? Maybe I'll do that. It is fairly square now. Maybe I will actually. That's sitting against the table pretty darn good. I think that's what we'll do. Let's just get on there. We'll get it something a little better to ride against. First, my battery's gone dead, so we'll swap that out. All right, I don't know if that's uh, moving around enough to get us or not. Swing that around a little bit more. Uh, okay. And then we'll do this one too. Pretty level, so we should be able to run that through the planer now. That even with that, pretty close for right now, anyway. So let's see what we can do with that. Uh, over here, see if uh, we can do it. And we're set back up to go on that. So we'll run it through a couple times. All right. Well, I took the boards back off of it after I run it through a couple times, and. Uh, Looks like number two looks pretty good too. So, so well, that, these all have to dry for a while. So that's board one and two, and a little thinner than the first one, but they could end up working out just fine after they dry. So we'll continue on with the other one, see if I can get another board out of those, those scraps.